What's up everybody? My name is Jason and welcome to 300 and $50 billion of SBA EIDL funding. Please do me a huge favor. Give this video a thumbs up, hashtag EIDL. And if you are new to this channel, you're going to want to subscribe and hit that bell. All right, in case you're just tuning in, you're going to get a half a dozen videos from me in the next 24 hours. I encourage each and every one of you to go back to the last two I've done. It's crystal clear. I'm halfway through the Senate hearings. It's Wednesday, June the 10th, 2020. And Ben Cardin so far is the absolute hero of the day. Ladies and gentlemen, what we, along with the other channels that have been fighting on your behalf, the small business owner across YouTube over the last two and a half months is starting to come true. I almost feel like I'm living a dream as we speak. Ben Cardin has taken the head of the SBA to task on multiple issues. Number one, you had no right to lower the amount from $2,000,000 to 150000 she had no answer, and she seems like a nice lady that's under a hell of a lot of pressure. She had no answer other than to say they were overwhelmed. They got over 4 million applications in the first week and a half. It obviously put the brakes on the entire operation. They've since outsourced $500 million worth to an organization that's connected indirectly to Rocket Mortgage, and the process is speeding up. But $350 billion, ladies and gentlemen, we're talking about a quarter trillion dollars is available. They've only funded about $75 billion. Over $250 billion is still available. There is no question in my mind, ladies and gentlemen, after the grilling that she is taking, and I'm only halfway through, that if you want a loan, an SBA EIDL loan, not only are you going to get it, but you're going to get it in far greater amounts than we thought going into today. The simple formula, as I mentioned in a prior video, is six months of expenses. So if you're running at 30 grand a month in expenses, you're eligible for that entire $150,000 limit. And after today, I'm not going to be surprised if they don't increase it, maybe even to the $2 million mark, because Cardin's not having it. Another thing he's not hadn't, having is the $1,000 per employee. This goes along, as I've mentioned, m a number of times with letters from over 50 congressmen and women from both parties. They had no right to limit. The only answer she has is they were overwhelmed and basically they wanted to make sure there were enough funds. But as he said repeatedly throughout the first 45 minutes of cross-examination, You've got $350 billion and you haven't even come close to using over $250 billion of it. Ladies and gentlemen, I'll be back in another hour, but there's no doubt in my mind, if you want the loan, you're going to get it in an even greater amount. And if I went into today thinking we had a 50% chance to get everybody the $10,000 SBA EIDL grant, I'm up to at least 85